left 6th Army Headquarters with very little information. The only advantage we had was the element of surprise. We faced a two-day walk through open terrain patrolled by the enemy. All it would take is a single Japanese scout to spot us, and our mission would be over. Let's go, Riley! Load them up! Drag them up! Let's move! We all knew the idealistic notion of rescuing POWs far outweighed its strategic value. We didn't spend much time thinking about it. As far as we were concerned, we were going to rescue them or die trying. They're gonna just leave us here? I have no idea what they're doing. Get this quinine to the doctors. You know the drill. Worst case is first. They must be retreating. Even the brass is leaving. Hey, Major. More is leaving, too. Looks like you were right, kid. General MacArthur's got him on the run. They're not on the run. They've got orders to fight to the last man. It's a trap. Goddamn elaborate one. We walk out those gates, it'll give them the perfect excuse to kill us. Since when do they need an excuse? I don't know about you, but I'm getting out of here before they change their minds. How far do you think you'll get, Captain? Even if the Japs are retreating, the jungle's gonna be crawling with them. What's wrong with that? We're still soldiers, ain't we? Hey, Major's right, Red. I mean, where are we gonna go when most of us can't walk? I don't recall inviting you, kid. What happens to the ones we leave behind? I never said we'd all make it, but at least some of us might. If we sit tight, all of us will make it. Our troops can't be far now. Looks like you've got yourself a disciple, Gibby. It might do you some good to listen to him. Get out there, Red. Don't make it any easier for him. Don't worry, I won't escape without your permission. Still believed in God. <laughs>